up this is another video update of my teeth i had had a lot of people send me inboxes uh, regarding to see where my teeth you know were at after getting my braces removed and uh, i got them removed i think it was march or april of 2013 so i have had them off for almost a year well like seven to nine months i believe and um i don't know if you can tell they're still pretty straight uh I haven't had any big changes regarding braces. I did stop wearing my retainer every day, day and night. I only wear them like sporadically at night whenever I feel like my teeth need to be um, moved back into its place. And I do remember my past videos about how I was telling you guys to always wear your retainers no matter what the ortho said about not wearing them in the morning, but just at night after six or seven months, I believe. Uh, but then it gets tiring and I also have a very busy schedule sometimes and I just get home and I'm like, I just wanna, you know, sleep and in peace and I forget to wear them all the time. So I've been wearing them, you know, like I told you here and there. And um, what keeps my mind sane about my teeth is that when I wear my retainers, I tried them back in September or something and I wore them for like, the first night was so painful i couldn't even like close my mouth completely because any uh kind of sensitivity or anything that i would chew even when the this teeth uh touch i will have a lot of pain and i was like let's try to sleep it off so i did sleep off with uh, i slept with uh, my retainers and the next morning you do feel a great difference in your teeth Let's say, I don't remember exactly how how long was it that I didn't wear my retainer. I think it was for three months straight. And yes, it was it's nothing that I recommend doing because you're paying for this. You are, you know, spending a lot of money uh, and having straight teeth. So in my opinion, it is my own fault. It is my own fault at all. Like, I cannot blame anybody about this, just myself. And yes, I have had a busy, 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 busy life for the past month. I moved to another state once again. So I've been uh, getting a new job and trying to uh, get accustomed to this new living. So again, my retainers are always next to me. Like, I have them here in my, in my restroom. And I have them there. I see them. I say had it every morning. But like I wear them at night only, so I've been wearing them and I noticed that my teeth do not hurt anymore when I wear my um, retainers, which is a good thing because my teeth are going back to its uh, original place or position after, you know, removing my braces. So I don't know if you can tell, but they're pretty much straight still. Um, I still have the bone loss over here on the bottom, but that's normal because I had my braces for such a long time. And also uh, a lot of movement was happening on my bottom arch. So the only way if I want to like cover up these little holes is if I do like a bone graft or something like that. But that's very expensive and I really don't need it. I don't have sensitivity when I drink or uh, eat stuff. So I'm okay for now. I hope not to have any future problems, but I've been taking care of my teeth. I've been flossing all the time and I've been, you know, using my Listerine and my uh, toothpaste and everything. So, so far, so good. Um, and that's it. Oh, now about the whitening. I did try the whitening. Uh, what is it? The whitening, not the trays, but the whitening, what is it? The little removable sticks. Not sticks, uh, I forgot. Well, the whitenings uh, from 3D White, something like that, Colgate, or was it Oral B? I forgot. But I tried them for a month and I did not see any changes. Once again, my teeth in the back are a little bit more yellow than the front because, again, my braces. So I, I didn't see any changes, but I was getting sensitive and I was like, nope, I'm not going to uh, risk my sensitivity levels and um and i stopped doing any whitening procedures on my teeth now i am working in a different office and i noticed that they usually do the whitening trays which are pretty much like this uh this is a retainer but they look like the whitening trays but this is not 
a hard material, but like, um, I think it's plastic, wall plus. No, not wall plus. It's just a plastic mold. It's a flexible thing that if you drop it, it's not gonna break or anything like that. And they give you gel, 35% gel, I believe. They have 20% too. So I think I'm gonna try that. Uh, it is $1.99 for both trays plus six tubes of the gel. I think I'm just gonna have to try and do that because it's a little bit stronger than the 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 Oral B 3D White. And um, um I guess if I start having sensitivity again, then I'm not I'm not eligible in getting any more whitening because I cannot allow this teeth to be sensitive to anything. So I guess that's all guys. I hope everybody is doing great. For those of you who are starting braces, good luck. Uh, just be patient. I know it takes a while to see, you know, changes and also um, it is a very long procedure. It's not, it's nothing that you can do about it. And for those of you who are getting them off soon, enjoy enjoy as much as you can uh, your braces because you are gonna miss them too so it's just so i don't know in my opinion i miss my braces but then again i don't want to go back to the point where like, i have to be cleaning my teeth after every meal this is so much easier and um i think that's all i don't have anything else to say i don't have any cavities or anything right now hopefully not for a while and if you have any questions you can inbox me anytime i had people that asked me where my braces were you know put on i did half of my treatment in new york uh it was flush in new york with the doctor dr lin hu and i had my rest of the procedures done in houston texas with dr vladimir tabakman you can google those names and that's it that those two were my um, original orthodontists and they did a great job. So um, if you have any more questions, I'll be, you know, checking my email for any uh, messages and stuff. But that's all. I hope you guys are having a wonderful year and rest of the month. Bye-bye.